Welcome to another Polkadot tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to explain how you can install the developer version of your Ledger app. This tutorial is meant for advanced users and we recommend to install the stable release of your Ledger app, always using the Ledger Live platform. Before diving into today's tutorial, if you find these videos helpful, please hit the like and subscribe buttons below as this will help other people to find our content. And if there is something that we didn't cover yet and you're interested in, drop us a message. Here we are on the Zondax GitHub repository. Zondax is responsible for developing Ledger apps for the Polkadot ecosystem. And uh, we can go under repositories. Here we have Ledger Polkadot. We can type the name for the app we would like to download. In this case, Polkadot. Then we go to releases. And we can see the most recent, the latest release is uh, release 16. On our Ledger, we can go and uh, see which version of uh, the app we have. We can see we have the version 15. We go and click quit. So we download the version 16 and uh, we download the one that is specific for our Ledger Nano device. In this case, we have uh, Ledger Nano S Plus. So we click on installer Nano S Plus. The downloaded Ledger app is most likely located in the Downloads folder. So we can now open the terminal. In the terminal, we can just navigate to the Downloads folder. When we are in the Downloads folder, we can make the Ledger app, the shell file of the Ledger app, executable. After making the Ledger app shell file executable, we can uh, navigate using the Help menu and see what option we have. We can see we can load Polkadot app, delete Polkadot app, and show the version of uh, the app. In this case, we load the Polkadot app. We type the name of the file with uh, a space, and then uh, we type load. We can see now on the Ledger device, we can uh, choose to deny unsafe manager, or if we go to the right and we scroll to the end, we can uh, allow unsafe manager. So we choose to allow the unsafe manager. The option we have is to uninstall the current Polkadot app that we have on the Ledger device. We confirm the action. Then we can choose to install the app Polkadot. The version is the 16. We can perform installation. We will be asked to insert our pin code. And after that, we will be able to have our Polkadot app. After inserting the pin code, we can uh, go on the Polkadot app. We can see this app is not genuine because this is not an app that has been installed through Ledger Live, but um, we scroll to the right anyway. We can decide to open the application. Then we can scroll. We can see the version is indeed 16. We can click on quit and uh, we are good to go. If you want to install again the most recent stable release, go to Ledger Live under My Ledger. Click on Allow Ledger Manager. You can see that although we already have the latest version, here we have a suggestion for an update available. And uh, we have this suggestion to, a bit, to update back to the most recent stable release that is uh, Ledger Live supported. And this is version 15. We can click Update All. And uh, we're good to go. We can check the app is uh, stable and is the version 15. All right, I hope you learned something today about installing the developer version of uh, the Ledger app. Uh, that is the latest version available that is not necessarily the one 
that uh, can be installed using Ledger Live. And uh, thank you for watching and I'll see you in another video.